This is Chris Coombs with The Truth and Diabetes. So, you know, I've got some friends that live in California. And they came out here for Thanksgiving. They said, oh, where's the snow? Well, there's the snow. And here's the other side of the snow. This is I-15. It's like 7.30 in the morning. And the road's been closed because apparently it's just been like a sheet of ice. And so it, it, it's barely moving. So that brings me to a point. Um, I'm not just here to complain about the snow and the ice or the wrecked cars on the side of the freeway because, you know, there's this neat thing that happens here in Utah in the winter. People think they can drive just as fast on snow and ice as they do on dry pavement. But anyway, so I got thinking about that and winter driving and diabetes. Being driving and diabetes in general, I know I've talked about this subject before. This is nothing new, but think about it going down the road something happens there could be an accident there could be weather you could have car problems this is my point always 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 be prepared good idea to have food I have food with me water I have water with me and your medication I have my meter my insulin I'm good to go so yeah I could uh, be out here on the freeway for a while but you know what never a bad idea to have like an emergency blanket you know make sure that you have plenty of fuel in your car but always better to keep your tank on full versus empty my dad told me that so just a few random thoughts as i'm driving through this wonderful winterland utopia anyway take care of yourselves take care of your diabetes remember disease or destiny it's your choice